I do want to mention, though, that rumor has it you were eyeing WCW also before making the jump over to All Japan. And Meltzer reported that prior to your deal with Japan, you attempted to get a $250,000 a year deal done with WCW. Is there any truth to that, or is somebody telling Meltzer stories? Uh, that, there, there may be truth to that. Okay. I mean, yeah, because if I'm gonna, you know, if I'm gonna go to work for another company, you know, I'm not, I'm not you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna leave the deal. I, you know, I mean, obviously with Vince, I wasn't on a guarantee, but the deal in J- the Japan deal was, that was a guarantee. I mean, it's like, you know, I was making a thousand dollars a night, so if I'm going on a five week tour, how much is that? That's an awful lot of money. <laughs> yeah <laughs> how many days and i mean you know like there's there's uh what seven days like five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty thirty that's thirty five grand Whew. a five week tour would be you know thirty five days that's thirty five grand but so no. you negotiated with w c w kind of saying like hey look yeah i've got all this money on the table of japan or i could stay home and make some guaranteed money from w c w yeah um but apparently they didn't go for it which honestly what a huge mistake on w c w's part at this time yeah. you know uh obviously nobody knew about your lingering injury but like yeah. uh, the the idea that they could have landed the million dollar man in their company at that time when they needed some help whew, they probably wow. should have pulled the trigger 